African Bank says it's looking to list on the Johannesburg Stock Exchange by 2025. The banking group has released its annual financial results for the 12 months that ended in September. Now it recorded a near 40% jump in profitability as it continues to expand its transactional base. Now the bank is also hopeful about recent acquisition moves in buying up a traditional mining bank, U-Bank, and small business bank, Grindrod. African Bank says it saw a significant rise in loan advances, reporting that net customer advances rose by 38% to 22.65 billion rand, while it recorded healthy growth in its retail savings and investment deposits portfolio. While market analysts have raised concerns for retail banks in a climate of higher interest rates, this latest result was welcomed. I'm just making a very serious inroad when it comes to the retail market. Look at the loan re retail loan disbursements up 87%. Look at their retail savings and investment deposit up 15%. That's kind of impressive. In the period under review, African Bank made significant acquisitions in its bid to diversify its revenue streams. It believes it can multiply the value in U-Bank, a traditionally mining sector bank that it acquired, as well as the Greenrod Bank, which largely caters for entrepreneurs, a market the bank says remains highly underserved. Greenrod is a successful uh, commercial bank and business banking, uh, largely in KZN and Gauteng. Uh, we want to uh, give them wings and support them with our a much stronger balance sheet to grow in the customer base they have currently. But in addition to that, bold onto uh, the green red um, rails that uh, 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 we find a digital SME offering that allows us um, uh, to support entrepreneurs much better in this economy. African Bank, which resumed full operations in 2016 following being placed under curatorship in 2014, says it will be undertaking processes to empower its current staff and stakeholders as early as next year. We aim to have a pre-listing um, sometime in 2023, hopefully by the end of the first half 2023, which would um, allow for all of our colleagues um, to, to be early takers of shareholding uh, at African Bank and also those uh, strategic and um, uh, uh, stakeholder partners that are integral to our ability to um, implement our strategy. The bank is hoping to open up share ownership to investment institutions and the general public through an initial public offering on the JSC by 2025. Nompumela Losiziba, SABC News, Johannesburg.